I'm John, John Fernandez. Uh, I now live in Iguazu and have a little bed and breakfast called Secret Garden Iguazu. I came here approximately 10 years ago and um, running a bed and breakfast is great fun, but it gives me a lot of free time. And then all of a sudden I realized I'm in a town where people don't know very much about where they are and what they're doing and even less about the history of the country. And I would often go to a point where the three countries meet, uh, which is called uh, the Triple Frontier. It has uh, quite infamous because it's supposed to be a drug center, and uh, I mean a drug uh, point of point of transfer. But anyway, I look out on Paraguay a lot, and uh, I suddenly realized I didn't know very much about Paraguay. And then, miraculously, I, r I ran across a book by John Kimlet, and which I love the title, at the Tomb of the Inflated Pig. It caught my eye and I started reading it, and really, it's such a well-researched book that I was amazed. And people here don't know very much about it, don't know much about this country, and I did glean so much information that I use it a lot to tell my guests when I get to that point. Uh, you know, I mean, it's amazing when I look at the river uh, Paraná. He, he says there that it's, there's more water going through that river every second than all the rivers in Europe combined. That's my favorite line, actually. And also that, you know, there are several, many, many, many pieces I can use from his book, which I do. And, uh, and you know, Paraguay, apart from being a contraband state, inspired my imagination of doing more on it. And I, start, I started researching a bit more myself, and I discovered the Jesuits and what the Jesuits did in this region. And together with a friend of mine, I, we did a compilation of stuff I researched in a, in a book called On Utopia in this region. Well, thank you, Mr. Gimlet. You've been very kind, and I really do admire and what, what you've done. Thank you.